Welcome to Mog House. Why? Yo, shut up, though! Check it. Mog is dead. Mog <laughs> is dead. Oh, my God! Mog. Oh, I bet Cloud's not having nearly as much fun right now. And furthermore, what am I supposed to do with all the gold points I don't spend? Please save all your concerns for the head of our complaints department, Mr. Coates in Corel Prison. Your complaints department is a prison? Ah, oh, common misconception. The complaints department is in the prison. Why is it in a prison? Needed space for the gondola. Plus, you've been caught red-handed for murder, so... We were framed! It was a man with a gun arm who killed all those people, maybe. Oh, this has been such a strange... Stressful day. What with counting all of my gill, cleaning up my priceless antique, souping up my buggy, telling a man in a black cape with a tattoo on his hand that I don't know what black materia is. Whoa, 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 hold on. Black cape? That sounds a lot like Sephiroth! Fluffy body broke our fall. Whereas my spirit was already broken. Where the hell are we? Corel Prison. It's completely surrounded by quicksand that'll drag you under faster than your self-esteem working for a corrupt organization. Working at Gold Saucer was really that bad, huh? Yeah, Gold Saucer. That's that's the thing I was talking about. Look, it's Barrett. Oh, kitty litter. It's the gun-armed man who moited all those people. If only I had gotten there sooner. Look, just because Barrett fit the description of the assailant to a T doesn't necessarily... The picture's worth a thousand words, Cloud. And all of them are f***. Cloud, where the hell did you follow me after I biggity bounced out of that station in a fit of rage? And where would you like to rate this rage on a scale of one to moiterous? I know, six, seven, who the f*** are you for asking? Wait a second. Where's Tifa? Where's Yuffie? Where's Red? Well, Tifa and Yuffie are probably off killing each other right now. We just got a We are killing it right now! As for Red, he seemed really hurt by what you said to him. None of us have seen him since. Barrett, we heard about what happened at the battle arena. You... you did? Yeah. Barrett, we have to know... Y'all need to leave. Now. This is something I need to do on my own. Please don't run off again, Barrett! Whatever's wrong, we can help you! We're your friends! I don't have any friends. They're all dead and they ain't never coming back. Are they dead because you killed them? Barrett. Come on, guys. Let's go and finish what we started. And furthermore, Mr. Coach! I'm gonna stop you right there, buddy. Uh, see, if it wasn't obvious, the complaints department is just the name of our prison gang. Oh. That would explain why your office is a truck. All right, rookie. Ready for your initiation? What are you gonna do? Stab me? Oh, you're gonna do great around here. Hey, this thing's got four walls and a door that locks from the inside. Around here, that's a friggin' palace. In fact, this gig wouldn't be half as bad if it wasn't for the boss. Yeah, that Dio is a real piece of- uh, No, 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 no. The new boss. You know what he pays me in? Is it spray tan? Because you are laying it on thick. Coats. But not just any coats. Coats of his victims. I've worn so many Giuseppes. So many Giuseppes. Sometimes he makes me watch while he wastes them. Eating coal with his right hand, mowing them down with that gun arm on his left. Wait, a gun arm? On his left hand? Coats, what else can you tell me about your boss? Well, he used to live here, back when it used to be a town called Corel. All right, the trap's been set. Now I just gotta wait to see if Barrett picks up the bait. Prison wives, your prayers have been answered! Awesome, it worked! Cloud, did you put up fake posters of there being hot single prison wives in my area in an attempt to lure me to this very specific location? The hard part was finding a printer. Looks like everything worked like a... Charm! Is it bedtime already? I would welcome the eternal slumber. See, this is why we don't get invited to mixers. Listen, Barrett, I figured it out. You're innocent, bitches! Check it. That jacket guy's boss is the one who killed all those people at the battle arena. What? But that's what I was gonna... Good job using your ninja eavesdropping technique, Yves. Thanks, Thieves. Hey, can we get those robots to take us on that sick drop again? That was lit! Oh my god, it was on fire? So there's another man. With a gun.
gun for an arm. Yeah. There is. It was four years ago. Oh, golly gosh! Our village! Your family! My dying now dead wife! To use Cole's superior clean burning properties for evil? What kind of monsters would stain its purity? Look, Don! Shinra troops! Maybe they'll be able to help us out! Guys, more innocent civilians! What should we do? Kill them? Ain't going out of style! Run, Barrett! I have a little busy dancing for my life right now! Shinra, they destroyed our village. They destroyed our coal! Why would Shinra do that? <laughs> yes, my minions! Terrorists who blew up our Mako reactor. But we would never blow up a Mako reactor. Oh, we know. We're just framing you. What? Oh, oh shit. shit. He was new. Ignore him. Now aim for Don and his sexually attractive friend. <laughs> gotcha. This is all my fault, Don. I shouldn't have given in to the temptation of modern technology. Just keep hanging on and you'll be back with your family in no time. No time's all I got, brother. Only one of us is going back to the village. Don't say that! I don't want you to die, Dan! Now what about- You take care of her, treat her as your own, and live by these words. Don't fuck up. Die! Remember the call! It was on that day. I first swore. Revenge? Okay, so we've got a few options. First, we have this new bronze gauntlet. I want a fucking gun. How big do you want it? There were layers of swearing, yes. Okay, so just so we're all on the same page, Dine is the killer, and instead of getting revenge on the company that burned down his village, he's just going around killing random people. So what's the plan? That's not weird to any of you. We gonna take him down or what? There is no we in this scenario, y'all. So for the last time, please, let me do this by myself. No! I'm sorry, but a good dog can't let his bestest friend do this alone. Red, how'd you find us? I followed the trail of dead bodies. Now I'm full. Red, I thought I told you I have no friends. Barrett, you told me that when you were but a wee lad, every day you would go to your church and pray to whatever God would listen, and you didn't care if you lost your arm, your friends, or the home in which you slept. All you wanted was a talking dog best friend. Now here you stand, armless and homeless, but not talking dog best friendless! Red. I. I'm sorry, Red! I'm sorry I caused you a bad dog and pushed you away! I just don't want the people I love to keep dying! Wow! Even me? Shut your f up, Cloud! the shot. I'm gonna find that, and I'm gonna make things right, and I'm gonna do it with my talking dog best friend by my side. Oh my dog, does this mean? Set your clocks red, because it's avalanche time! Avalanche time! Avalanche time! Avalanche time! Yeah, let's kill people! Dan? Is that you? Hey, brother. Long time no see. <laughs> oh, that's foreboding! Oh, shut the hell up! This is my moment! It has been a long time. Four years, if I recall. Yeah. <laughs> Four long years with no coal to light this dark world we live in. Dan, I came to apologize. To make things right. Make things right? <laughs> you can't make things right, brother. No one can. She told me so herself. Who told you, Dan? Your wife? No. <laughs> My mistress, Cole. Ooh, that's weird. But Cole and I have become one, brother. 
He tells me everything. So did the Cole tell you to murder all those people at Gold Saucer? Yes, she did, brother. <laughs> and did the Cole tell you why? Why? <laughs> Does there gotta be a reason to why people do things? <laughs> You think Shinra had a reason to burn our town to the ground? It was only when I fell into darkness that I saw the light. This world is a cruel place, brother. Everywhere I go, all I see is death and destruction. Probably because you're the one causing it. This planet is so full of resources and people just a Use it! People like Shinra! The planet gives, gives, and gives. And all we do is take, take, take! How are you not dead yet? You got shot like 50 times! Shinra took everything from me! My home, my family, my coal. I've got nothing left. That's not true, Dan! There's still someone left. Your daughter, Marlene. I knew it! I went back to the village and found her. I've been raising her ever since. She's a healthy eight-year-old girl now. She looks four if you ask me. Marlene, my daughter. The coal's telling me something, Barrett. It's telling me to see Marlene again. Oh, that's great. Wait for it. So I can send her to her mother. No, nothing but that. Dan, wh what are you saying? What I'm saying, brother, is that it's time to dine with death. Oh, that's good. Dan, it doesn't have to end this way! Yes, it does, brother! I shall reunite you with the ones you've lost with my coal gun. At least he's consistent. Dan, for the last time, I'm not going to fight you! You have no choice, brother! Because if you don't, my path of destruction will continue, and this world will be rid of every man! No! Woman! No! Child! No! And dog! <laughs> hey, Don, you know what time it is, sucker? Excuse me? I said, do you know what time it is, sucker? Avalanche time, motherfucker. Oh. I'm glad to see you've only suffered minimal damage from that head-on grenade explosion, Dan. Now come on, let's forget all about this. Head back to Midgar and see Marlene. <laughs> you know I can't do that, man. How can I hold my daughter with these hands so stained? My hands ain't any cleaner, Dan. If you put them together, you'd have a pair. <laughs> Read the room! Barrett, you want to get out of here? Show this pendant to my man Coates. Then give it to Marlene. It was a mother's. Dan, I... Don't let anger and hate control you. Don't do what I did. Be better. Use your gun to shield the planet from Shinra. A gun can't shield things. Now my other hand! Dan, I... I promise. I'm going to protect this planet at all costs. But let's do it together. We can involve coal if you want. My coal is burnt out, brother. Farewell. And remember, don't fuck up. Dan! Dan. Dan! Do you think he's all right? Well, he survived it the first time. Nope.